Today I'm going to be doing a review on this lovely one cent coin. It is a Canada coin and the date is 1940. So it's a wartime coin. It's got April leaves in the middle and on the same twig, as you can see. The edges are smooth. Um, it is made of bronze. These coins um, of this date go anything between 15p to a pond, or in a peasant condition. More to a pond if it's like uncirculated condition. More to 15, uh, 15p if it's good condition. Um, so, the, in weight this coin is 3.25 grams. The diameter is 19.05 millimeters the thickness is 1.65 millimeters even though it's only one cent so that's basically like having a penny over in the UK sort of thing but collectors will pay more for it but it does change throughout the years how much a coin is worth and throughout the years, it has been going up slowly, how much it is worth. Now, they minted this in um, the Roy Mint in Canada, in Ottawa, Ottawa, <laughs> Canada. And it was 85 million they minted. So that altogether, it was 85 million, 700 and 40,532 coins they minted in uncirculated condition. So it is a really common coin. And even though I've told you it's worth between 15p to a pound oh, in a pound condition, that's how much collectors will pay for it. You can always get it cheaper if you go to your local antique shop and you can find it there cheap okay um also if you're always on holiday and you want a canada coin and you go to canada you probably get them you probably can get them for a lot cheaper as well so you know under the 15p mark so um always look and don't get conned on ebay when people put them on there for like 50 quid and stuff and saying they're aware and they're not do your research when you buy a coin so thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed and stay tuned. Oh, also I wanted to say who designed the coin. So on the reverse side, George Edward Cougar Gray designed it. And then on the reverse side, Thomas Humphrey Padgett designed it. You can see the initials right under um, Charles's neck. And then you can see the initials right by there too. So thank you for watching and stay tuned for more reviews. Bye for now.